Hello. Oh, we on? We're on. Yeah, we're we're going strong. Yeah. What's up? Uh, hey, welcome to the new time. Welcome to the new place. The new time and place yeah, for the foreseeable future. Nine p.m. Nine p.m. Exactly on the dot. We're ready. Yep. We're as with everything. As always, we are adjusting to our new lives. We are right on time. At nine o'clock. Yeah, which this is, is already like, late for me. I want to go to bed. To the mat after dark. We were gonna play something spooky, but then I figured that why not wait till after Halloween? Yeah, Matt was like, "Yeah, we could." Then uh, let's not. This is spooky enough. I mean, look at these snow creatures. They're pretty, they're pretty spooky. Yeah, I'm spooked. Halloween always takes place in a snowy mountain with um, pine trees, snow, snow-capped pines. I feel they're just gonna keep appearing. By the way. Well, I'm just trying to get around. Infinite spawning. I mean, I think I gotta get on this thing, right? That. Yeah. You did it. I, well, I know. That's. Ouch! 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 <laughs> ouch. When, I've never heard him say ouch like that before. Ouch! Ouch! How is there so many snow creatures? She's. Aw, oh, man, Scoob! Aw, oh. oh, jeez. How's everybody else out there in TV land? Damn it. <laughs> Please tell me. I'm curious. Come on! Oh, there we you go. Did it. Oh, come on! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Damn it! Uh, that's it's fun because it's not happening to me. No, I'm having a good time. What were we talking about before? The Basketball. No, before that, when you were like, we should be talking about this on the stream. Uh, fucking cock ass. Yeah, it was funny, whatever it was. It was the s slogan of a generate. We said. Said something. Hey, what's going on? What's up, uh, Maticon? Oh. Triple wave. We got the triple wave. That's three waves. One, two, three. Oh, dead. How did I die already? We got hit three times. That's the standard video game length of life. Uh, no, I feel like this is... It's affecting me. Had some za where, there, uh, where there so happened to be a comedy show, but very not good at first. Did That's you what know? we were just talking about. That's right. Did you know about the uh, comedy show before you went there? Or did you just go there for pizza? Because I said, Tim, like, I like stand-up comedy. And I said, I like stand-up comedy if it's good. And I really don't like it if it's bad. And there happens to be a lot more I mean, I'll still watch it if it's bad. No. <laughs> it's just painful. But uh, what I enjoy is, like... Are these good things to hit or bad things to hit? I think they're, they're good, but I don't think you can get into them. I forget how. Was the pizza good at least? Oh, if it's from the spot, it's good. It is. I have not had it. I really like Snug's Pizza. It tastes like a good time. So you should get it is what I'm saying. Is it? Is the crust zero carb? No. It's like, it's regular crust. Well so it's then. not, it's not like... Candy Crust. Candy Crust? Yeah, my favorite mobile, mobile game. I left early, so it was a bad comedy show. Yeah. Uh, the spot has had... Oh, Jima Slices are the best. Is that Grandma, grandma slices? slices? What's a Grandma Slice? It's like a like a square of pizza, but um, it's kind of like French bread almost. Okay. What are you... I don't know. Just I'm, not, I'm not purposely doing this. I'm thinking about Spooky pizza. game. Uh... I've not played it, but it is very, it's like horror, first person horror, like spooky exploration, like liminal spaces kind of stuff. I live in liminal spaces. Um, Do I want to get under this ice? Is that the whole goal? You, uh, you can. Not from here, though. Look at this little guy. Um, the spot has had a good comedy show there before. Oh, this is where I came from. Yeah, they have. They should have us back. And I don't. I don't know what happened there. I feel like someone. I don't think. I, I just think they didn't. They didn't like pursue it further than that. I think somebody dropped the ball like, yeah. on our end. 
Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I just don't yeah. think anybody pursued it. And I'm concerned that nobody is going to. Because LBC is like, hey, we'll take it back on Thursdays. I mean, our last show was good, by it the way. It was good. Hey, we're all, we're you all. Nobody came yeah, to our the, show, and it was the good. One. It was a good show. Um, the audience was kind of small, but decent size. I was. He, oh, no, not that show. I was out of town, I think. Oh, that was a good show, though. I think I was out of town. That show was tight. It was everything was cohesive. We didn't know you were doing a show. We advertised it. But did you specifically tell the Maticon? I don't. I think so. I think so. I don't know for sure. I think I gave you the date of our next show, but maybe I'm lying. I didn't know I could do this. That's a cool move. Yeah. Georgia. I don't know what I'm doing. You're just killing these infinitely spawning I know, creatures. but I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Um, not here. Okay. Is this the thing I want? Just go that way. I don't know. But I, like, I, do I want fire? This is like, now your attacks are powerful. Finally. Oh, yeah, there's a thing around the corner you're supposed to... Oh, you already, we already did that one. See, I don't remember what we did already. Likely story. Being in Georgia, not knowing there was a show. These all sound like excuses. That's true. Those are literally excuses. Two brain hamsters. Drunken hamsters. Maybe I'll go over here. Oh, this is I slidey. See. Ah, wow, I didn't fall down. Hey, there's a thing. There's my guy. Oh, yeah, this is good. This is a fun one. I'm having a fun time. Ah! <laughs> you gotta go up there. Drop, do a drop kick on that button. Drop kick? Yeah. Like that, but on the button. No. What? It moves at an angle. That's weird. Yeah. You got it. Now. Oh. That way. Shit. You're timed. Oh, everything's slippery. He moves at such a pace. Don't fall into the. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have like a float. He gets like a little double jump float. How was I to know? Following costumes. Um, mine and Sarah's was we did. Um, I didn't even have to. Oh, you could just step on yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, if you have you seen Beetlejuice, um, the two dead people, Alec Baldwin and Gina Davis. That's who we were. Uh, my wife and I went to the Halloween party that we had, uh, dressed as our children. It was super funny. Uh, I think we won. Yes. The Halloween cost the contest, which was the prize was a pineapple. You did, and I ate that the next morning. Yeah, I cut it up the next day. It was good. For for brunch. It was great. Which like everyone brought sweets to that brunch. Not me. Yes, you did. What did I bring? You brought empanadas. Fuck. I did bring empanadas. Everyone brought sweets. Like there were two boxes of donuts, a peach cobbler, and empanadas. And I was like, well, I'm glad I made, I'm glad I made like a savory thing. I brought the empanadas because I didn't want the empanadas because I didn't think that they were very yeah, good. Yeah, that's absolutely, I knew you did that. I didn't think they were very good. <laughs> so you're like, here's some trash I can pawn well, off Well, I didn't know friends. if anybody else would want them. I, I have very different, fuck me. Ugh. Also, hello, Red13. Welcome to the chat. Welcome to the chat. They were from New Mexico. They were authentically made in Authentic empanadas. New Mexico. Save your vegetarian. Yeah, like, so I, I was like, I was glad that I made the sweet potatoes. Um, by the way, I can't stop thinking about the Chipotle sour cream that I put together, and I just want to eat that on, on literally everything. Ah! <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm doing fine. Yeah! I have this nice hot chocolate in oh, front and, of me, and, and Mary, I didn't like, any of it. Mary made some uh, smoked sausage, which, not vegetarian, but... No, I didn't have that. You know. The the potato stuff was good. Oh, you missed it. Some eggs would have been good, and I thought about doing it, but I don't want to make anything else. What's up? What was everybody else for Halloween? Mr. What were their Hill. costumes, or going to be your costumes? Yeah, lots of black beans. Ereviste. 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 Hey, what's up? Lots of black beans. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the recipe for the sweet potatoes thing actually called for corn and black beans, but I decided uh, not to. 
Because I was like, there's already a lot of stuff in here. The cast iron was come full. On. Come on, come on, oh, come on, come on! You fool. Oh, you did it! Yeah, but how long must I wait? Yeah, I just want to eat that on everything. I want Chipotle sour cream on every food that I ever eat. It was really easy to make. Uh, I just blended some, like, the canned chipotles in adobo. I just processed some of that and then mixed I've done it, it into a tub of sour cream. It was Everyone like, praise me. You did great. Tell me I did a good job. You did great. That I'm the bestest boy. You're the bestest boy. I'm really making things happen Look, over here. Oh, uh, you opened the gate. I love a black bean burger. Oh, so good. I like when a place will make their own instead of like heating up one up. Like the frozen ones that, yeah. yeah. Way better than when they make their own. Frozen ones are better than they make their own? No, it's better when they oh, make their oh, own. Oh, yeah, Like yeah. EMT has a really good black bean oh, burger. Oh, man, I love EMT. Where do I go from here? Does one just die? Oh, this is going to take me back. Yeah, that'll take you up. Does one just die? Yeah, we were talking about Halloween costumes. What was your Halloween costumes? So anyway, on Halloween, when we take our kids trick-or-treating, I'll probably just wear um, this onesie <laughs> and like a moose hat. We usually just go like in normal clothes and wear a hat, like a moose, or we have a panda hat, we have a Pikachu hat. Uh, we just wear something, because the kids are like doing their stuff. We don't want to dress up. Sexy vampire. Uh, redundant. Wait, the gate that you open is back that way. Back that way? Yeah. Up there. Keep no. Keep, follow the ice. It'll be on your left. Right there. Right there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what these are, but I'm gonna go on them. A V sexy vampire for a V sexy party. Hey. The thing with quinoa, and I used to, I, I used to really eat, like quinoa, but uh, I am not a vegetarian. I do like vegetarian food, but I have recently started like no. a, a low carb diet. So quinoa is not that. I just had quinoa for lunch. It was very good. Quinoa is good, but like I'm avoiding grains. So I'm eating like meat and vegetables. Salad and steak. I had a salad with quinoa in it for lunch. I don't know if I said this. I had quinoa for lunch. Oh, man. The Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy was really good. Before Mike barfed all over the party. <laughs> I read your quote, your comment. Uh, did you want me to ask about the party? How was your party, Tyrant Heel? What am I supposed to do now? I'm Fall stuck out, at the down a lot and die. Oh, am I supposed to activate those switches then? Yeah. To get those things. Oh, okay. But now there's monsters. Did you have quinoa at your at your party? Was your party dramatic? Did you have sexy quinoa? Again, redundant. What kind of a vampire were you? Redundant. An energy vampire? Or a blood vampire? You basically just have to follow that thing. Oh, yeah, you can go up there. That's um, right. Yeah. Now I have to go down. Yeah. You did it. But you basically just follow that catwalk around the perimeter of the fort and do different stuff. Ooh, I love doing different stuff around the perimeter of the fort. Now I got them all. Have you seen uh, What We Do in the Shadows? Still want to see that. No, I haven't seen it. Oh, it's so funny. But one of the characters is an energy vampire, and it's really funny. I, I, it looks right up my ass. It's that so, show looks it's completely so up my I ass. I haven't seen the most recent season, but the first season is so good. Recent season. The re reason. Recent season. Yeah, you gotta go that way. Right yeah. there? Well, I don't think you can make it over there from here. Mm. You gotta go back the way. That way. This way? Yeah. So you go over here. I think there's something to do. Hi, Veracity Jane. Or maybe I, oh yeah, down there, see? If you turn around. Oh, right there. And go down this. I can go down this way? I think so, yeah. Oh, that's hidden. It, it, yeah, the camera is not responsive, or not, not not responsive, not uh, ooh, not. Um, We're all watching what we do. Yeah, it's so so funny. Coordinating with me. 
Gracie Jane wanted to pop in and talk about agreeing with me about shows. What shows? What we do in the shadows. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can do one show at a time, and it's right now it's Great British Baking Show, which I was upset with, and I posted on Instagram about Dis- Disagree about, about it being good? What? Disagree? <laughs> disagree about what? You just said yes, Something good. Disagree. At the funeral. What are you disagreeing about? Oh, my God. Yeah, don't don't know what you're disagreeing about. <laughs> the camera being bad? It is bad. In this game. Yeah. We'll never know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, ne- we'll never that's, find that's a, out. That's a power move. Just <laughs> walk in and say... Pop in and agree with me. Oh, oh, well, that is literally what you did. You popped on and said, yes, good. I have to go soon. But what we do in the chat is super good. Like, you just popped on to agree with me. Like, even if that's not what you meant to do, it's what you did. It's effectively what happened. Ipso facto. Oh, boy. We got a logic, bro. (laughs) We got a logic, bro. No, that didn't work. (laughs) Well, God. IFF. I hate these losers. Yes, if IFF. Um, Love a good math shorthand. FFT. Like the BISS postulate. Fast Fourier transforms. Are you aware of the BISS postulate? This? Yeah, so when I was in college taking Euclidean geometry and we had to write all these proofs. Yeah, you did. My friend would throw in the BISS postulate every now and again. And then finally he was like, what is that? The greater. He was like, I, the rest of your proof is fine. I didn't understand this part. And she was like, oh, it's the because I said so postulate. <laughs> he had just been like counting it fine because the rest of her proof was fine. She would just throw that in there every once in a while. Proof this is a triangle. <laughs> I see a triangle. Is it, is it not? <laughs> is it not? It prove it's not. <laughs> Why is the burden of proof on me? <laughs> You should start going, like, because proofs are all about, like, starting from, like, first principles and then, like, extrapolating everything out. This should just be, like, go way back. Like, what? (laughs) What is even a line? How can we be sure of anything? Yeah. How do you define this plane of existence? Yeah. Just go full full etymology. Speaking of planes, let's talk about the plane of existence. (laughs) (laughs) Who likes math in the chat? I know at least one... Oh, what are you doing? Well, I was trying to get him because I kept slipping off. Okay. Just double jump and then do the spinning thing. Can I have you play for five minutes yeah. so <laughs> I can drink some of my hot cocoa? Never heard of it. If, it's if this, then that. Math? math? She's like, I got to go, but wait, are you going to talk about math? We got math in the chat. All right, go. <laughs> What do you have to go for? Just watch more of your TV it's show? It's 9.30. What are, what are you, you even going? doing? It's too late. Anything that happens after You're 9.30 like on, is bad. You're like house arrest anyway. You're like stuck at home right now. Where are you even going? Oh, yeah. Veracity Jane has the plane. How you feeling? Yeah, are you feeling okay? Can't you just say that confidential information? I do always like math stories on your Instagram because I think that they're funny. I never look at other people's Instagrams. <laughs> That's not what Instagram's for. It's for like me touting my own stuff. Well, see, that one's tough. Listen, that was the first time I've tried it in I years. Know. I guess I can watch this on YouTube later. Ack. Wow. Wow. Where are you even going? Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. The Ack. ultimate betrayal. You do barely have an Insta. Bye. But I. But I, I have two. Yeah, but they're not identified as you. So what? So I, I mean. Oh, I just walked off. <laughs> Kathy's got a YouTube. Uh, Ack. <laughs> yeah, Ack. I understand. Like, I, I think math oh, you know is a what? fascinating concept. And it didn't. I was okay at math for a long time. It un, unintuitively, math didn't really start to click to me until I got to calculus. 
and that's when math like really started to like I got well, I it doesn't, to get it. You know, it doesn't make sense a lot of it before you get there because it's I like agree. it's all building blocks. Yes. And kids are like, what am I gonna use this? And like you're probably not even if you go into math, like this isn't I would even the thing. I would even say learning calculus you don't have to learn all of it but like learning the fundamentals of calculus earlier would help with some of the stuff you learn that you have to like memorize yeah it's just that the the problem is kids hate math i know but i think that's largely cuz how it's presented I, I well the thing is it's like a it's like a um a vicious cycle where like it's presented in a certain way the kids don't like it so then like we dumb it down even more and then kids are like well this is really why do we even do this right like, we just want kids to pass algebra right right so it gets dumbed down and like distilled into it's like ba the super basics and then they're like what 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 is even the point i totally agree and i'm like look i i could explain the point to you but it's not in the standards leave me alone no i i agree i, I think that the way we teach math is ridiculous um, I learned geometry in 10th grade, never used the material until I taught last year. Exactly. That's when I learned, I think most people learn geometry is in about uh, the 10th grade. Uh, ninth grade. I said the most. I'm not saying everybody. I, because I never took, I was not in advanced math when I was in high school. I didn't start taking, uh, some serious math until I was in college. And I was at a deficit, uh, when I got to college because of how much I had ended up having to take for my degree. A um, math deficit. So I really had to like learn or relearn a lot of the stuff that I was never taught in high school. Um, oh, what the? I, the so double jump. I, the double jump didn't work. When I got to college because everyone, it felt like everyone was either had taken calc in high school or had taken more than calc in high school. A uh, calc one. Um, oh good, this is on Oh now. nice, that's smart. That's nice of them. <laughs> No, I agree. Like, it, it's, it's, we like fail to teach kids, like, because I don't think that math is that far removed from like any of the other things we study, but we, we categorize it like it's this totally foreign thing, and that like you're either are an artsy person or you're a math person but i think that they're all the same like it's just it's, it's just activating one part but it's all of the same sort of like learning but we have to like demarcate these different sides yeah you right like cs and i just can't i mean my degree is i have a minor in cs but i have an engineering degree um, and that is what i do for a job <laughs> no <laughs> I, I went too hard on my attack it's it's slippery out there. This hot chocolate is. I really just enjoyed excellent. Uh, the computer science classes I took at Purdue, but not I, enough I really, to be like this is what I want to do. I really like coding. Um, it's oh not necessarily what of course, I went to all the coding for. I did was just HTML and JavaScript. Yeah, which is pretty much what everybody does these days anyway. If you're in uh, research computing, you use Python. Whatever. It's it, once you learn the fundamentals of computer science, which I think is true too. Once you learn the fundamentals, the language itself doesn't matter. You just kind of have to learn the syntax of it. Oh man, you did it! Hero of the day. This is where I fell off the fourth. Oh, it's there's, slippery. There's nobody on it this time. I was a CS minor as a senior in college, so I took a bunch of classes for freshman. I made me feel dumb. I mean, if I don't expect people to like anything, I don't expect people to like know this stuff off the bat. Um, there's, uh, I took CS uh, when I was in high school. I had a lot of classes. I was very lucky in the amount of strange classes I was able to take in high school. Like I took, I can take it from here if you don't want to play anymore. Or I can leave you. But um. That's I, fine. I'll keep going. I uh, was able to take um, programming classes as a freshman, uh, sophomore, and a junior. Um, they had, like, the vocational section of our high school, so, like, people that they did not think that they were going to go to college. So they had, like, a shop and, like, all of these things. And they put, like... Um, certificate programs so mm -hmm. they had like net plus and like a plus which is like computer repair and like computer networking you can get a certificate in so i took those which is great um and i got net plus certified uh but i took both of those classes and they had japanese so like all of these classes that were like not to totally typical of a lot of high schools i was able to take and i was very grateful for that yeah 
What programming even was there when you were both in high school? <laughs> Shut hey, up. What the? Wow. What up? Okay, so honestly, programming languages, they evolve, but they are not that different from when they were like right. in the, the early 90s. I'll say is when they started to really solidify. So I took, I took Visual Basic, which is no longer around, but it's called Visual Basic.net, which a lot of banks use. I took Java, I took C++. Both of those heavily use languages these days. Uh, heavily. Um, so yeah. We had to bang rocks together when we were in school because they yeah. didn't have computers. We had to do Morse code. <laughs> yeah. Back in my, okay, one of my least favorite jokes that I think every old person makes, um, and I try very hard to not do this, is when you're talking to a younger person than you, you talk about a medium like magazine or newspaper, and the whole thing is like, if it's you like an iPad, yeah. the page it's like, I just want to rip my ears off when I hear that because I'm like, shut up. It's not like people don't know what this shit is. You can go buy a newspaper right now. Tim learned today that Taylor Swift wasn't even a person when he was in high school. <laughs> she, she, I think she was alive. First album didn't come out until the year after. I yeah. <laughs> I don't think she was dead. She was not even a baby yet. I, Taylor Swift's what? She's not that much younger than we are. Uh, yeah, she is uh, three years younger than me. Yeah, not that much. Is Japanese a coding language? To be honest, I don't even understand what an A-track is. It's a tape. It's a tape. It's, it's just a different form of a cassette tape. It's a big fact. It's got tape. eight tracks on it. It's what, um, it, this was well before my time. Like, well, well, this was like in the 70s. Um, it was what you, it was uh, the first way to like listen to music in your car. That was like its major purpose. Yeah. My dad had an A-track player in the garage. Yeah. They sound like shit. They're they're not good quality. They're they're terrible. If you think cassettes sound really bad, A tracks sound worse. We just kajunk. Yeah. Just stick them in. There's not a whole lot of nostalgia out there for people like collecting A tracks. Okay, that just seems. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Back I in my day. Anything to do with age. I'm pretty sure that uh, for anybody on this chat right now, all 50 states were around for our entire lives. When I was a kid, the United States wasn't even a country. I'll never be that old. I have a distinct memory of realizing New England was not a so I mean, it's kind of that's kind of like that weird stuff of like, why do they call it that? Like, you why do they have off. a football team? Yeah. Which, by the way, go Bears. They won. They beat I know. the Patriots. Loved it. Like, I don't care about sports. I'm like, yeah, yeah. get out of here, Patriots. Yeah, fucking like, yes. Cares? I think we can all unite behind that. But you were dressed as your kid, and he Oops. loves sports. He loves sports. Big sports guy. I was talking about New England once, and Brad and Jane started talking about Europe. Oh, yeah, so funny. <laughs> what? Was Veresi Jane not aware that New England was a not in Europe? Is that what was that what that, I'm Basically, to here? that's what happened. Oh, okay. Okay. Again, I mean, I think that that's probably like you pick that up from context. Old England. Old England. I just now realized that New England wasn't a state. No, I don't believe you, nervous. Get out of here, nervous hair. Get out of here. You. That's not true. I don't believe it one bit. Oops. She wasn't sober. I wish it wasn't true. No, come on. It's. Take the poopy dog out. New England is a state of mind. Do <laughs> 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 you have to like stomp down on that? Oh, you just pull a lever. I think I just have to stop them from doing their stuff. Oh, okay. Well, well you I did, did that. that. I didn't see the new Pokemon yet. 
I have the game pre-ordered. The I am so excited about it. There's one more of these guys somewhere. Um, I plan on streaming some of that new Pokemon when I get it. I actually think that um, I might be taking the day off the next day, depending. I ordered s Violet. I ordered Violet. It's down here. Woo! That was a close one. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yes, Poke Stream. I would get it, Tyrant Heal. Yes. I believe I will be joining you, Red 13. The problem with this map is it's like a lot of it is it's like impossible to know. I, it's it's hard to navigate. Yeah. I wish there was a mini map. I know. Oh, we gotta go through these trees. Like, how are you supposed to know that? Right. He's got this big thing. A suggestive thing. Oh. Nope. Ah! Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are those things? Oh, you know what they are. But I'm trying to figure out what they actually are. Big old pistons. Sure. <laughs> oh, good camera. I'm just, I'm, I'm transfixed by this. They're a plot point. They're a plot point? I don't know. They're just like a thing to get in our way. Whatever the opposite of a Deus Ex Machina is. They're machine weens, according to Nervous Hair. Machine weens. Machines. I'm opening the yellow eco vents. <clears throat> I have not mastered all the trombone songs yet because we played them all. <laughs> we played it once. Um, Isn't that enough for you people? I had a friend of mine come up from Indy to hang out, and he, he played it, and I, that's the last time I played it. I came from there. It was. It was. It was tea dang. Tea dang. It was fun. We played a bunch of fighting games. We watched the Purdue football game. Yeah, he's great. That was the night of debauchery. Just us guys doing so much debauchery. So much debauchery. Yeah. We went to the bar, we left early, and uh, we played fighting games. Very debauched. I don't know why you guys don't play Brawlhalla with me. I, I, we've played Brawlhalla. I have nothing against it. I think it's fun. Seems like you have something against it. I absolutely don't. I need to come buy you drinks and dinner. Just come by. You don't have to buy me anything. The last time you came up, I was unfortunately out of town. Um, but hopefully that won't be the case. Well, you I, I was uh, I was running that race. Which, by the way, Purdue Half Marathon in a bag. Only one more race of the year left if I don't do the Santa Hustle, which I might. Uh, there's something about being in like zero degree weather running that just yeah but it wasn't even that cold when we did it no but the, a couple years ago it was zero i had to like yeah. wear my balaclava and everything it was so cold i don't know where to get these last ones man i would love to do a polar bear plunge legitimately i've always wanted to do one Something. Where you're what? Balaclava. It's like a. It's a face. It's face, a face scarf. Thing. Thing. It's it's the things that like when you see like people robbing banks. That's what they're wearing. It covers your whole face. <laughs> My baklava. <laughs> The 
The worst part about running in the cold with that thing on your face is when you're, um, you're like breath and like oh yeah, like it snotty gets so wet. and it's like snotty. And if it's really cold, it will freeze. Like it'll warm. It'll put yep. like a frost layer on the outside. Okay. And hopefully they don't make you run on anything too icy Here because that um, that can be really dangerous. Thanks. Um, it wasn't my best time, but it was considering my time from the marathon, like a pretty good improvement. Um, I was I was pretty happy with it. Um, they all, for some reason the the people who do the the organizing for that half marathon they did a they changed the, it was a completely new route this time. Um, you don't go into Lafayette at all because it's stinky and it's where the pores live. Of course, <laughs> you don't ever want to go to fucking no. Pawnee. You only want to stay in Eagleton. Um, coming from we're in Pawnee right now. Um, but because of that, I, they had like no toilets. They had. One at seven miles and one at nine miles. And then they had no public restrooms at the start. They were all just whatever was at Ross Aid Stadium, which was like not enough time to get everybody in. And so I was like holding it, I had to stop to use the bathroom. I hate, I, I never want to use the bathroom when I'm running, even like a full marathon. It sucks. Yeah, um, when I did the half with the Santa Hustle, I didn't use the bathroom. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to, but I, I had to. I tried to get. Um, I tried to use it beforehand. There just was nothing. Uh, it sucked because they had porta potties, but they were locked. Because uh, Purdue wants to keep homeless people from using the fucking porta potties, so they don't. They lock them not on game day. Is a beardy boy frozen beard is a thing? Oh, totally. Get a little ice school beard action. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, we're getting close to Matt grows a mustache month. What month is that? No November. Oh yeah, I don't participate. I've never participated. I just I want a mustache and it seemed like a good a time as any. So we're doing it. Oh my god. <laughs> just none. Everything else. Be as hairy as you can be. Just shave your upper lip. Is this where this thing is? I'm a I'm a pretty hairy guy in general. There's only one person I know who's got more more hair than me. And that person is nervous hair. And every single one is nervous. Yep. Definitely. You got that Greek magic. Okay, I just don't know where the freaking frozen crate is. <laughs> that should be your name. The that Pickett. should be your, your username. I get the thing. Um, I don't know if it happens to anybody else. So my name, it doesn't have very many letters, but it phonetically, it's not spelled like you would normally spell it if you were just sounding out phonetically. So every time I go to a store, every time I go to a, a thing where they have to ask me my name, I instinctively spell it out, but they always think that they're gonna get way too, like they know this, what are you talking about? So I'll hear, uh, what's your name? And I'll say, you know, my name, and I'll say my last name, and I'll start to spell it, and they'll have to go backspace, backspace. Can you say that again? Every time. Without fail. Yeah, well, don't have a, such a weird spelling of your name, man. Uh, well, it's not really up to me. I did already go down there. I just, there's a frozen crate somewhere, and I don't know what Oh, yeah. I'm sure you do nervous hair. I'm sure, do people even take a stab at it? Do they start to spell it before you get going? Why did it put me all the way back there? Well, Caitlin, you got that you got that uh, that New Jersey name. Yes, correct. I actually got it wrong the last time I said it. Luckily, you weren't around. He did, <laughs> and he didn't think he did. Yeah, because there's like a bunch of different spellings of that one for for Caitlin, at least. Oh my God. <laughs> I make them try. Even a solid mustache would be neat. 
I have never grown facial hair for a long time. Um, I yeah. I, but I, I have to shave like same. every day. Like, yeah, I same. get a lot of facial hair. Just in tiny patches. Mine's not patchy. It's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was at the Halloween thing. I think that's when um, we were talking about you. Because I made some joke about New York. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I know. We were asking, like, you weren't in town. So I was asking where everybody was. Um, that's why. Good night. Thanks for stopping by. Um, excuse me. Do you have to get in there? Oh, nice. Just going back. Go back to the crater. Here, you can do it now. Okay. I'm doing it. Like, what a long cutscene for no reason. I think I, I think it's because they're loading. Yeah. I think that it's trying to hide a load. Yeah. Clever girl. Mm-hmm. That's why if you ever play, this is a secret that you probably all know, but like if you ever play a game where there's like a long elevator sequence, it's almost <laughs> surely just hiding a load scene that they're just loading in assets. Mm -hmm. It's not It's not like, oh, they don't know that this is long and boring. Hey guys, by my calculations, it's going to take 72 power cells to fuel the Ichio against the lava on the way to Gaul and Yeah, bust that thing. Oh, I didn't know I could. I thought it was one of those things I wouldn't be able to bust. Yeah, you can bust that. That's those scout flies. Other one. What? It's a uh, jumping and square. Yeah. Like oh, that. I hit it. It just wasn't taking it. No, I didn't get my library card. I haven't been in the library yet. I did check out Hoopla. I'm all signed up now. There's still books that are on my list that sadly <laughs> are not on either platform. There's, see, there's another one over there. Oh, you gotta get on the cart, son. I'm on the cart, son. There you go. Yeah, I haven't been in the library to renew my card yet, so I haven't uh, successfully set up Overdrive yet. I I did Hoopla. I'm excited about Hoopla. I am on a 12-week waiting period for most of the books on either one. There's another one in there, I see too. it. I just want to get these eggs. Yep. Um, I, I'm so glad that they exist. I wish that the wait times were less. So there's one over there. I want to get all these. Yeah, I'm saying like there's another crate. Yeah, I'm saying, but like my goal, I want to get them all. All the, all the boxes. Okay, yeah, because that gives you a power cell. Let me get all. Which seven. I need 72 of them to for that heat shield. I think we have 72. Oh, okay. I could be wrong, but I'm sure we have all we need. I think if you stay on that cart, it takes you to Spider Cave. But don't I want to get the other one? Yeah, eventually. I think I want to get that box. Yeah. The Everytown USA School School Polar Plunge is in February. I'm down. Oh, the school that Matt already talked about. Good one. I Good one, idiot. <laughs> So much machinery. It is. So much activity. The chicanery of this machinery. <laughs> what a normal place to build a house. Oh. Do, do we already do this? I don't building? know. It's like where we where we came from. Hey guys, keep collecting power cells. They're the key to continuing our journey north. Whatever. Keep reading your big books. Keep having your underwear stick out. What is, what is this, the early aughts? It might be soon. Early 2000s. Some low-rise je yeah. jeans and whale tails. Ja Jack and Dax are all like into Kiera. Oh, yeah. You Kira? have to destroy the dark eco-crystals in spider caves. Okay, man. Thanks. <laughs> I like how I yell at you and just stare at you for a second. Look, you idiot. You have to destroy them. Hey, has anyone seen the new Star Wars yet? Um, like the show? Yeah, Andor. I saw the first episode. What'd you think? Is there only like three episodes? I don't know. I was distracted. It was fine. I want to watch it. Um, but again, I'm on a one show at a time person. 
I never even finished um, Obi Wan. Oh, I loved Obi Wan. I thought it was fine. I finished it. I devoured it. Obi Wan's my favorite character. Yeah. So. It's a good character. Where do I go from here? Did you ever watch those red letter media? Of course. Reviews of like yeah. Star Wars. I had, like so those funny. were classic. So funny. That was like where they got big was off uh, episode one. Yeah. And all those. Yeah. Yeah, because everyone's like, yeah, uh, absolutely, episode one. Oh, sucks. I can't get up on here. Nah. Um. Yeah, I. Uh, you win McDonald. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't watch much red letter media, but I did watch those. Yeah, same. I like how it's like, you have these two characters, Obi-Wan Kenobi and Qui-Gon Jinn, and they could have been one character named Obi-Wan Kenobi. Pretty much. It's like Qui-Gon Jinn, unnecessary. But they do they do make Qui-Gon Jinn uh, in Obi-Wan. They make him more important. Oh, he, is he in Obi-Wan? Or is he talked about? Yeah, Red Letter Media. Between shows one. I, I thought the stuff about like the hooker in the basement was weird. Definitely weird. Like, like uh, that, not, that, not necessary. I, even when I watched that, which was, I guess, more permissible back when that first came out. I guess. Even though it, it was like this is un, this but is it, dumb. It was it was not good. No, I was uncomfortable with it. Like it's not funny. No, it's not funny. It doesn't add anything. I don't watch a lot of their stuff, so I'm assuming they got away from that. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, super strange and off-putting. Oh, everyone's laughing because I like pizza rolls. Well, how about I have a dead woman in the basement? Yeah. Um, oh, we only have 60 power cells. I, I'm hearing good things about the Game of Thrones show. However. Uh, same. Yeah, same. However, the original run of the show put such a bad taste in my mouth that I cannot bring myself to watch But this. here's the thing. I felt the same way about the original run of the show. Hey, Power Cell! <clears throat> and then I went back and binged it. I just watched it straight, yeah. beginning to end. Oh, you should watch Firefly. Yeah, Firefly's great. Uh, I watched it. Oh, nice. From me, and it was really good. No, the ending is no. Off-putting. Even the last seat, like okay, the 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 actual ending, it's like they rushed the end of the show. It, I agree, but I think the year and a half wait. And the weird way they did the last season was was so off-putting in the moment that it was like I waited a year and a half for this. I don't think it. I don't think it would change my opinion. But when I binged it, I was like, okay, this actually isn't that bad because when you watch it all together, it feels more cohesive and more like fine to, uh, to me anyway. It, yeah, it felt better because I I remember like when we watched it live, I was like. Oh, this is terrible. Nope. Why are they doing this? Why is this happening? Um, but when I actually binged it, watched it all together, not waiting a week or whatever. Oh, yeah, this part is so frustrating. The worst ending. Show the worst ending. The lost. I had, didn't watch Watch. Fuck, I hit the button. Lost. Um, I heard people were very frustrated with Lost. Um, I never got into it. So. Lost was like... Hey, let's have a cool idea. And then they're like, oh no, they, we've re- they've renewed us for another season. Oh no. Oh. Oh no, we have to keep writing stuff. Oh no. Oh, speaking of Star Wars, oh no, did J.J. Abrams start the story and fucking beef it on the end? Oh, Star what? Wars, terrible. Fucking bad. They bad. got set up for an interesting end to Star Wars and he just phoned it in. That last, they were, I think they were so worried about fans. Don't be. Star Wars fans are the worst. Do the what you want to do. They were like, you know what's a good idea? Horses in space. Horses in space. Oh, uh, uh, what if we, like the previous movie, we, we introduced this character. I thought it was very interesting that they were like, what if there was a person that just didn't have like a, a, like a big ending? Like they were just like an interesting character. They didn't have to have like this grand connection to any of the Skywalker shit. And then J.J. Abrams said, what if I, what if it was bad? <laughs> what, what if it was bad though? And everyone's like, "What? No. What if all it was was fan service the whole time?" God, J.J. Abrams. Am I not supposed? To I have that? also complained about his Star Wars or Star Trek reboot. So I saw the first one, and it was fine. I enjoyed the. I yeah. so I enjoy the movies themselves. Just what a what a what a mishandling of the ending of of the second one. 
Uh, the X Files. Wow. I, I. It's been such a long time since I've gone through the X Files. I remember really liking the show when it was new. Stranger Things. Uh, and not not big loss. It. Like kind of lost energy, but not really. No. Not not really. I wouldn't say. I'm losing it over here. I don't know like where I'm supposed to go or like where's my path. There's no. It's no. There's no path. Well, I know, but I'm supposed to get somewhere. Yes. Correct. I don't like Spider Cave. It's not fun. I like the aesthetics of Spider Cave. Sure, it's not fun. But no, I'm not having a great time. Oh, come on, really? Ha Silent Hill 2 is such a classic horror game, like psychological horror. And they got JJ Abrams doing Well, it? now it's going to incorporate the Skywalker family. Thank goodness, right? Skywalker. That that movie, Rise of the Skywalker, did it had a terrible kiss that was unearned. The whole thing was bad. It was so bad. And in the moment, I was in such deep denial. I was like, I remember having arguments like, no, it was actually good. Oh and God, it was like, no. And I was just like, I just wanted to like it. It's, the it's whole a time shit I watched movie. it, I was like, what? What? Shit. Movie. What? What? And I'm a. I mean, it doesn't take much to impress me. Either. What if the bad guy was the original bad guy all along? I'm. I'm the prime audience. What? I got, if, I, what if there's a million of the bad chips and they're just there? I have a Star Wars tattoo. I'm the. I am the audience you want, and I thought it was god awful. What if? What if? What if she's a Skywalker? I am supposed to get somewhere. I'm not like this in most video games. I swear. It's where every time I get on this show, it's like when I'm playing Hotspot. It's like, name a song, and I'm like, I've never heard music. What's it like? <laughs> Songs? Ugh, I've never, I don't know, I've never heard one. <laughs> never listened to a song. What's a show you were surprised to really like? Um, good question. A show that I was surprised that I really liked. Great British, great British baking show. Oh, I knew I'd like that shit. I did not think I'd like it. I'm Ooh. not a big, I don't really like reality TV that much. Yeah, but um, it's baking. I know. It's a cooking show. I love cooking shows. I, I, I agree. I'm saying I like it. <laughs> I'm just saying I knew I'd like it. Oh my God. The s'mores though. I, oh my God. I, I haven't seen any of the recent seasons. So I, that's why I can't talk about it. But I posted. I assume Instagram. they butchered them. Because it's, when they're ever they're doing any kind of like yes, American treats, yes. they're like, hmm, pumpkin pie. That's a savory pie, right? Yes, that's exactly the same energy that uh, that was brought to that. Well, you know that there's a s'more, but like, God, I was yelling at the TV. Saltines. <laughs> I uh, and eighty percent dark cacao. I was like, this is just you've lo <laughs> you've lost the spirit of the s'more. I'm gonna have to watch it this season. Yeah. What are you watching it on? Netflix. Oh, sweet. I was honestly so I because Why is your jump so bad. I resisted watching Rick and Morty for so long because of the fan base. Ter worst honest. fan base. Worst fan base. But I started watching. I was like, oh, okay, this show's pretty good. They um, they have one of my favorite episodes of like a, a time travel thing. Like I thought it was really smart, smartly done. Uh, in season one, um, I, d I have not seen the recent episode. I haven't gotten it's that a, far. It's I've, been a I'm while. like three or four episodes in. Oh, I can't expect to jump to the island, but you know. <laughs> oh, the Walking oh, Dead, exactly so though. good, so good. Until 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 they just focus on Morgan for two episodes, two, two seasons straight. I liked probably the first like five seasons of The Walking Dead, and then it was a f slog. It does. I'm 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 uh, trying to finish up the last season. I'm all caught up now. No, I stopped watching it's it. It's still happening. I can't believe They're it's still They're on the happening. last season right now. I can't believe it's still happening. Well, the last season was in three parts. They're on the third part. This is ridiculous. <coughs> That's a crime. Uh, uh, this is one of my favorite episodes. It's called Pickle Rick. God. No, see, that's the one. That's the one. That's like. I think that's why he's saying it. Yeah. But yeah, Walking you Dead. You can't make your personality Pickle Rick. You can't. Also, Fear the Walking Dead. I just... I think they wrapped that up too. Exactly. Amaticon. Get the fuck out of here, Jack. But yeah, early early Walking Dead is such a good show. Yeah, I really liked it. 
I remember I was living and But to be honest, the zombie thing has like lasted a lot longer than I thought it would. Like I remember what I was gonna say, speaking of zombies. Um I got a VR headset. I'm part of I'm part of the metaverse. Me and Zuck were together. Look at you. Um I, I didn't buy it, I got it from a friend. Um it's an older VR headset, but it still works. Anyway, so I I have it not fully set up yet, but I have it temporarily set up. And I started playing the new Half-Life game, Half-Life Alex. It's different when you're in VR. Like, I didn't think it was going to make that big of a difference. But when the, like, head cramp zombies are, like, right here. Sure. It is... It's scary. Are we going to play that on the stream? We can. I have to get... I'm, I'm, like, mounting the sensors and everything. I'm actually getting, like, the proper setup. I have, oh, like, nice. temp set up. Cool. But, uh, yeah. Wait, hang on. I did. Uh... Why the Last Man? I watched it and I it's fine. It. It's I fine. Read it. I read it too. Um, it's fine. Where am I supposed to? Where are you I don't. Me? I I wouldn't say it was a. It was so good. You need to see it. Why the Last Man? Um, but it was it was good. I can't believe it actually got made. I know. Um, <laughs> yeah, I've got. I had no complaints. Uh, grown up Mike wants us to play Subnautica also. So, I have Subnautica. I don't have the VR Subnautica, though. Oh, yeah. Look at me go. Somehow. I did it. You're doing what to the sensors? He's I'm mounting, mounting them. them. Because I don't want a bunch of cables. I'm gonna, I'm, cause Watch my out for him, man. Basement. He wants to rear your child. <laughs> gonna, and I actually put them in the ceiling so I, like it's not. it looks like it's seamless. Um, but, yeah, we can play VR. There's a VR game I did want to play called... Um, uh, stop talking and nobody dies or don't stop talking and everybody something like that basically one person's in vr and they have a bomb and then one person's outside vr and they have a manual oh. and so the person in vr is supposed to be like okay there's like a there's like a red button on one of the sides so you're like flipping through the manual that like, sounds fun the bomb. yeah that sounds fun we should, that yeah. sounds fun um i think that this is because I ended on a high note and uh, there's nothing more I can do. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it's time. <laughs> it's time. Um, yeah, thanks, everybody. Um, no, actually, uh, Tyron, you know, I think there's one more season of Fear the Walking Dead, actually. I watched all the Fear, I think. No. No? I mean, I don't know if you did, but I just, there was a recent season this past year. And oh, there's then one, no. There's one more season. Um,. Yeah, VR is super fun and scary. I don't know how anyone would play a horror game in that. It, uh, like, my brain is too like, hey, that thing in front of you is super real and is coming right at you. I have a problem with horror games, uh, not in VR, so <laughs> I, get, I get so spooked out. They have Resident Evil 7 and 8. I'm like, something's going to jump out at me. I remember um, Like Doom playing, 3. I was like, ah! Uh, Red 13's brother came and he brought PSVR, which is like not a great because it's running off a ps4 original so it's like the fidelity is not great it's not tracking but he had resident evil 7 and i remember like being in that game and i was like ah because i <laughs> normally horror stuff doesn't really bother me it's just different when you're like in it i'm just like i know there's gonna be a jump scare i know it's gonna be a jump oh, scare that, yeah absolutely i'm gonna get jump scared i think i remember um grown up Malk, like playing that and he like took the set the headset off he's like no i'm done i'm done <laughs> yeah anyway uh, thanks everybody. This is fun. Uh, yeah, we'll nine o'clock, nine p.m. We'll next see you week. next time. Next next week's gonna be the spooky stream. <laughs> so uh, the post Halloween spooky but, stream. Yeah. So everyone, uh, remember to to bring your spook your spooky selves. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Costume contest in the chat. Oh man, yeah. Send us your <laughs> costumes. That would be cool. Send us to your uh, to our Twitter account. Um, thanks everybody. We'll see you next time. On the next time. Fart. <laughs>